Hello guys, Márcio Barbosa here, yes, I'd like to talk real quick about the uh, super match coming up in Australia, Australia, uh, Mr. Ryan Bowen, Ryan Blue Bowen against Lachlan Aldair, mm. for the number one spot in Australia uh, it's gonna be very interesting in this match I mean both guys are friends but they just decide to put that on the side and just you know fight for gold you know for glory and uh, honestly um, for what I saw it looks like Lachlan is stronger than Ryan. Uh, he has more arm strength and, you know, wrist flexion and uh, back pressure. He seems to be overall stronger than Ryan. Ryan has going, has gone up in weight. I mean, you used to see Ryan at, you know, 200 pounds. Is like 225 pounds, but also Lachlan, it's like 245, 250 pounds. He looks much heavier. Uh, let me think about it. I think I saw those. Uh, they did some kind of a weight in last week, if I'm not mistaken. And kilos, I think Ryan weighed about 100 kilos or 102 kilos. And Lachlan weighed about 112 or 113 kilos, something like that. So let's say the difference between them, it's like around 10, 12 kilos in favor of Lachlan. And Lachlan is already stronger than Ryan. I don't know what kind of trick Ryan's going to pull off, but I'm interesting to see because in my for those practices there they they were doing like I don't know how many times they practice a lot together and but seems like Ryan found a weakness in Lachlan and that's how it is you practice with somebody for a long time for years and even if you know the other person is stronger you always find some you know some areas that you you're gonna you know, you're gonna prevail somehow. It could be endurance, it could be pronation or the super, whatever, whatever fundamental and whatever area it is. So, so Ryan knows where his chances are and Lachlan knows exactly how he needs to pull Ryan. So, honestly guys, honestly, I don't know the outcome of this match. I tend to think that Lachlan could win, but I don't know his endurance. And I know Ryan, Ryan probably has more endurance. And we'll see, Ryan's been showing, you know, his gains all over the internet. And we'll see if that plays out. I mean, what do you guys think? Uh, Leave your comments below what you think about this match. Very important in Australia because Ryan is very famous there in the world of arm wrestling there. And uh, he's been promoting, uh, you know, a lot, you know, arm wrestling in Australia. I mean, before Ryan, I only knew maybe a couple guys from Australia, but Ryan definitely is bringing the sport to another level there, which is very nice. Good job, Ryan. And now it's it's the fight for the number one spot. So, guys, the only thing that I have to say is good luck to both of you guys. I know you guys are very dedicated, and uh, I'm wishing you guys to be able to compete outside of Australia, uh, in U.S. or anywhere in Europe. 
I mean, there are so many good matches there. Of, of course, over there, I think it's closer to you guys and come to America, but uh, good luck to both of you. Uh, I think I saw, I think Hutchins and somewhere else said that Ryan got, got the key, got the key to beat uh, Lachlan. And uh, honestly, guys, I would like to hear your opinion. Please leave your comment below. What do you, what do you think about this match? I mean, Ryan definitely more technical. Lachlan definitely more, definitely stronger. But I I heard they're gonna pull like six rounds. However, the winner had to win by two. Like, if it goes, it could be a four-two, a five-three a 6-4, a 10-8, something like that. They have to lead by two. So, it should be, to be no doubt. So, that's why it's very interesting. If it's only, if it's, if Ryan managed to, to win any match or make it go in deep waters, I think he can win. But definitely, I would favor Lachlan. Um, no, or maybe 50, 52, 48 to Lachlan because I don't know where Ryan's at. I don't know where Lachlan is at because I only see him them pulling in Australia. So good luck to both, and I can't wait to see the match. I think it's very, it's going to be very interesting. And uh, leave your comments below, guys. We will, we will, we will know the number one guy in, in in Australia this Saturday coming up. Good luck, guys.